Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Marcus Aurelius, and this is Crusader Kings 2 After the End. And we are, of course, the Kingdom of Gran Francisco. Are you going to Gran Francisco? Be sure to bring a weapon or two. For if you're going to Gran Francisco, there's sure to be someone trying to kill you. <laughs> we are at war right now for Tahoe, and we are winning it, but our enemies are all over the place. So we're going to continue this war, and I'm going to have a hit of ale. Or porter, to be honest. All right. So... For reasons that are inexplicable to me, Jefferson is helping the Emperor. They will arrive in Tuolumne at 22 July. If I try to catch them, I will arrive 31 July. So let's let's take out the 10 August, 2 August. Okay, so we'll be able to stop these guys at least. Which we should be able to do, although we're... And we have a claim on San Jose. All right. Things are going to go well this episode. I can feel it. Although we're down from a high of what was like 8,000 to 5,000. That helped us quite a bit, though, stopping those guys. The thing is, though, we are now not a whole heck of a lot better than this army here. So we're going to head on over to San Jose. But in the meantime, we're going to raise up some mercenaries with our substantial amount of money. Cold to the apples still around? They sure are. Okay, guys. Head to San Jose with the rest of our buddies. Excellent. Levy reinforcements are high. Where are you going now? Stanislaus? Come on, mercenaries. I don't have all day. All right, let's go with this guy in the middle. And Craig's already in there, so let's go with morale damage. Alex, you're on it. You guys are heading to Stanislaus. Let's meet him there, huh? Oh, they didn't like that. Well, you're going to like this even less. Come on. No, I'm not going to call to your arms. Now, they have a bonus here, but we have probably better commanders and more troops. So, yeah. We slayed Pella Nekalina. Well, they're finished now without Pella Nekalina. <laughs> I hear he was their combatant with the longest name. And done. We're at 67% war score. Thought it might be better than that. Oh, it's because this Jefferson guy. Actually, you're going to Fresno. We're going to follow you. We're going to finish you off, and then we'll head up north from there. Okay. Here we go. Gran Francisco is proving to the world that there is naught that can stop us. I wonder if they're going to stay there. Looks like they are. They aren't running yet. Some of them are running. I cut my young ward, Princess Twin Peaks, torturing a rat. Tell her about kindness. Alright, she's kind. Good. A daughter was born to Jocko Glass and Princess Tenderloin. Named Tenderloin. No. How about Knob Hill? Well, actually, Knob Hill's kind of a guy's name, isn't it? 
Um, how about Golden Gate? There we go. All right, so we're so their armies are pretty much crushed. This peasant revolt has disappeared. I guess we'll try to catch this army about a thousand here. Oh, they're going to get reinforced. So that'll help. Oh. Candlestick Aurelius needs a guardian. Who are you exactly? You are Presidio's son. So you're my nephew. Alright, are you good at anything? Well, you're just a kid, so we don't really know. You're good at learning, though. So let's have someone who is good at that educate you. Like Albert. Perfect. Alright, here we come. They're massing their army here. Alright, so the, there's a usurpation in the Wineland. I'm not too concerned about that. Treasure Island is an intricate web weaver. Excellent. Man, my kids are amazing. But are you, you're not better than the one I currently have, though. Yeah, you're slightly not better. But we could always use more claims. Or I could just marry you off to somebody. No, I think I might want you to be a countess or something. So let's matrilineal marry you to... Okay, why is Jocko... Tenderloin died? Of pneumonia? Alright, well... That means Jocko's free. Matrilineal marriage. You can marry her sister. I don't... I am not being notified when people are dying. And maybe because I'm not doing a good enough job keeping track of my family. I don't know. It's getting kind of big now. But someone should have told me that she had pneumonia. Oh, it says there at age 17. But that needs to be a pop-up window or something. I'm going to have to fix the... Uh... A son was born to Presidio and Cara Felicianis named Chris. No, you're not going to name Chris. We're going to call you Knob Hill. All right. Let's head on up to Sacramento and put an end to this. We're at 94% war score. Betrothed can marry. Matrilineal. Pogatel Glass. In prisons of Pacific Heights. Yes, let's do that. All right, good. Prove the marriage, please. Thank you. Who else is there? No, he values. Yeah, Prince Tucker. What the? I'm confused. If she's betrothed to Prince Tucker, is he like in jail or something? Maybe, oh, maybe because we're at war? That might be it. All right, we're just going to have to wait. They're still betrothed. No skin off my nose. In fact, I think it's time to have some ale. All right, so you. You are now going to fabricate claims in Josephine. We will expand our empire. Although we could use Contra Costa as well. Actually, we could take away Contra Costa using a plot. And then take away San Jose in war. That is an idea. 99% war score. Come on. Just give it to me. There is an old hermit somewhere in the back country of San Francisco who is said to possess great wisdom as well as a razor sharp wit. Some claim he once served in the clergy. Others say he was a mercenary captain who decided to put down his arms for good. 
Whatever is past, many seek him out for counsel. Will you? Heck yeah. I'm ascetic. We love that shit. Done. Excuse me, Emperor, sir. I'm going to take that county from you. Thank you so much for your time. And now that that's done, we're going to marry. Matrilineally, please. What do you mean, no? Yeah, Noe Valley's awesome. I'm... No. It's, it's matrilineal or nothing. Yeah. No, we're not going to do that. Noe Valley is... She's ugly, but she's amazing. So, we are, uh, we're not going to do that. We're going to not do that. So, let's see here. Noe Valley, we are going to break betrothal. I don't care if the Emperor doesn't like me. There's no way I'm not matrilineal marrying her. She's fantastic. With a mule as your only company? Why? You're the king of Grand Francisco. Bring a guard, for God's sake. You depart for the hermit's cave. The journey is long, and the roads, where they exist at all, are in poor condition. So, yeah, pretty much like the Bay Area is today. Finally, after reaching the end of a narrow mountain path, you come upon the cave. A ragged piece of cloth is all that shields the entrance from the outside elements. The cloth parts slightly to reveal the face of a gnarled old man. He regards you in silence for a moment with his beady eyes, then disappears behind the cloth again. No solicitors. I have traveled far, old man. I will not be denied. You push the curtain aside and enter the dark cave. Deep inside, you find the hermit, seated on a cushion in flickering candlelight. He seems to be in some kind of trance at first, but then he opens an eye and looks at you with mild annoyance. I thought I said, Oh, spit it out then. What do you want? I want to share in your wisdom. May I stay? I guess so. After much badgering, the old man finally relents and permits you to stay for a few days. You observe him carefully and learn as much as you can. In the end, his wisdom seems limited to an endless stream of platitudes and maxims. You have memorized many, and at least they will make you seem more learned in the eyes of others. Excellent. Let's pick an ambition. What I really want is martial skill. But they won't let me have that. Stewardship, I guess, is the next best thing. Oh, because my martial skill is 8, right? Okay. So where are these... Okay, you're the Redwoodian Peasant Revolt. Even though there's like 85 of you. So let's go... Right, are you are you gonna allow this divorce or not? You're a major character. You're a major character. You're a major character. You're a major character. Okay. How about all you guys? You're a major character. I feel like Oprah giving away cars here. You're a major character, and you're dead. And you're a major character. You're a major character. You're a major character. And so are you. Alright, so now we have our entire Aurelius clan here. Noe Valley. We are going to get you matrilineally married to... Wow. Okay, so three of these people are your actual family members. But Alex isn't. Alex has pretty good marshal. So if I ever give you a county, he's going to do a good job of it. Although you are ambitious. He's my courtier. There's really no one else in the world that wants to marry you. Seriously? Alright, whatever. Alex? Natural little marriage to Snowy Valley? Whoa, I'm down in Southern California all of a sudden. 
So the Emperor absolutely despises me. Title claimant? Really? Well, I mean, I couldn't do it anyways. I'm at peace with them. 100%. Offer the peace. Excellent. What's this? Visit Imperial Court? Yeah, I'm sure I'll be... Sure, I'll be welcome there. Okay, retinue. Let's go back to San Francisco. Why not? I guess it wouldn't hurt to make him like me more. My wife has already proven herself a decent regent. I'm starting to think that Jill might fancy me. That's not appropriate. Come on. Nicole's fantastic. She's amazing. Why on earth would you cheat on Nicole? Okay. Getting some prestige and favor. How are my vassals doing here? Yeah, they're a bit upset. And Tahoe, yeah, Tahoe. So now Prince Thou is one of my vassals now. Even though he technically is a prince of the valley. So we're in good shape. And Prefect Divine has her entire prefecture. So let's see about... Okay, so Countess Beatrice. Okay, let's go Intrigue. Known plots. Sweet. More prestige. Tell her about honesty. She's become honest. Kill Noe Valley? No, God, why would I want to do that? I just got her married. It says Joaquin has arrived at my court. And he died in my dungeon, like, immediately. Panic is spreading in San Francisco among the common folk. There are reports of eerie sounds and big footprints. We did this already. I will hunt down the beast. Nicole Camus died a natural death. You know, we could really use Brave. With an unearthly, bestial noise, a terrible creature lurches out at you from the shadows. It lunges towards you and your men with fearsome madness in its eyes. It moves so quickly that you barely have time to react. Kill it. Uh-oh. After a swift and brutal fight, the beast lies motionless at your feet. But it's not a beast. It's a man. Looking at the hairy and deformed body, you can see why ignorant peasants might have thought him a monster. But you should have known better. Okay, so we, we lose karma. That's fine. But did we get... No, we did not get brave. Well, it was only a 25% chance. Alright, come on. Let's get out of the Emperor's Court and let's... So apparently we cannot plot... Oh, because we're on... That's right, we're on... Pilgrimage. Right. Well, while we're doing that, let's have some ale. Or porter. I don't know why everything has to be ale. Where are you from, ladies and gentlemen? Is there a particular brewery in your neck of the woods that makes good stuff? Let me know in the comments, and maybe I'll try it on air. Who knows? In the meantime, this is the longest pilgrimage I've ever been on. Alright, Pacific Heights. Pacific Heights has a son, and Bay Point is actually a mistaken name. It's actually Bayview. And we'll, we'll have him be young Bayview Aurelius. That's fine. Which one is that? No. Oh, who are you? Golden Gate Aurelius? We're going to make you a fancier person, too. And, oh, Bayview. Yep, you're fancy. Oh, yeah, we don't care about you. You're outside the dynasty. Little rugrats. 
You're not Aureliuses. Aurelii. Be sure nice if we can get that claim up there. That would be great. My favor with the Emperor is secure. That's great, considering I declared war on him. Alright, the Regency has ended. Now, Contra Costa County. Let's see here. How do I do this? Intrigue. Is it down here? No. I... I'm so sick of this. I'm supposed to be able to just... Oh, you know why? Because it's... Yeah, he gave it away. I get it. Alright, never mind. We are going to revoke your title. Since we have a claim on it. Oh, we got the prefecture? I thought we got the county. Interesting. He's one of our he's one of our commanders. Oh lord. That's not good. All right, so here's the thing though. If we get the prefecture, that doesn't actually give us any land. But then we'll have a claim on all the land. But we'll have too many prefectures. So the first thing we're going to do here is we're going to go to the prefecture of Salinas and we're going to destroy it. It's going to make Craig hate us. Craig is going to be pissed. You know, we could just give it to Craig. We'd lose two counties. He loves me. You know what? You know what? I'm going to do it. You're going to get the Prefecture of Salinas. And all the lower titles. Alright, so yeah, we lost a couple counties, but that's okay. Because now, we can revoke the Prefecture of Hayward. And he says, maybe. You better say yes, dude. Nope. He is not down with that. So, we're going to have to show him what happens when you behave in such a manner. Okay, so, you got, let's all, everybody's going to meet in Grand Francisco, except for you two. You're going to meet in, I guess there. What else do we got here? You guys you get disbanded. That's fine. All right. Perfect. Perfect. Things are going great. And then I can have Dejure claims on all these, and life is good. All right. This is enough. Let's go to San Jose. Do you know the way to San Jose? <laughs> Where are you going? Contra Costa? Yeah, go ahead, do that. Oh, cool, we're getting more reinforcement. Where are you going now? San Joaquin? We're gonna have to meet you there. He's gonna get there in time to cause a real ruckus, but he has a negative modifier. If they can just hold, lo out, hold out long enough, come on, guys. Come on, hold out. You're strong. Yes! My sweet Nicole is terrifying when she wants something. There is nothing she wouldn't do to make me bend to her will. Now she wants one of her friends to be upholder of ceremonies, but upholder of ceremonies, Orizaba, is a very competent man. Okay, Orizaba, you have 22, and you're 21. Nicole, I'm sorry, but I'm not going to do that. You can be upset. But you'll get over it. We're going to go to San Jose. And it looks like we have some titles here. Libationer. Mel? You're our Libationer. Love me. Who are you? 
decanter. Yeah, you're good. I'll take you. Excellent. And you know what? Let's just finish this before the end of the episode. Let's let it go a little bit longer. We are already at 70% nearly war score. You've discovered papers which document a tenuous claim on the border county of Mariposa. Woo-woo! Let's do it. He is repudiated. I will not forget this insult. The Emperor's will is law. I will not forget this insult. Get ambitious. No. I guess nothing happened. Screw you, Emperor. You're next, buddy. Let me just tell you. You're on the list. Where is Mariposa? Well, who are you? A white piece? Are you high? I'm going to crush you and everything you hold dear, white piece. Where's, isn't Mariposa like somewhere in... Seriously, where the heck is Mariposa? Oh, there it is. Boom. Not that it matters. The Emperor will not give it to us. And he shall rue that. He shall rue the day he crossed the King of Grand Francisco. Really, you guys can't, can't siege this down? Come on. You're better than this. Prince Alcatraz is a mastermind theologian. Sweet. You are an important character. You are awesome. But you're chaste. That's okay. That's okay. We'll arrange a marriage for you. Marina? Isn't she related to you? She has a claim on... Everything that we already have, including Hermosillo and Nogales. Mendocino, wow. Yeah, you're related to us. But I guess not. I guess you're far enough related, so it's... Not a problem. What do you have? Ensenada? A female marshal? She has a claim to Deer Lodge, but she is a Gaian. Alright, let's sort of keep it in the family. She has a lot of claims. Okay, we'll get some prestige. Sounds good to me. So let's get that going. Alright, so Prince Alcatraz, where are you exactly? You're in You're in Grand Francisco. Frankly, I wish we had something to give you. I kind of want to give away our second barony, but now is not the time since we barely have any land. Once we have all of Alameda County, then I'll give it away. In the meantime, I guess you're just going to sit tight. Build the dynasty. Because I want all three of these counties and all the money that comes with them. Money, 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 money. Money. Man, our terrible martial score is showing. <laughs> we need a we need a leader who has good siege ability. Or we need to, to get the tech on siege ability or something. And we keep getting more tech. We can do town infrastructure, church infrastructure. Oh, awesome! Alright, do we want majesty? Legalism. Or Noble Customs. Noble Customs is actually... It'll help our feudal vassal opinions. But legalism... Majesty will give us more... 
Karma gain. And less short rain years. Oh boy. Now nah, we're going to go with Noble Customs. Just to keep our vassals happier. And for this... We're going to wait. Well, 600. It's going to be a while. We're gaining church infrastructure anyway. Town infrastructure, we're not. This could lead us to have more money. Let's do it. Seems like a wise thing to do. Now, can we please conquer this place? And do you mind? Okay. And this place actually has even more defenders. How are my vassals doing? Only Blanket is upset. Or Blanken. But that's funny. Didn't I raise vassals from these other guys? Maybe they all got killed. Who are you? You're just a raider. Come on. Let's end this thing. Let's put an end to it. 100%, ladies and gentlemen. Offer peace. Force demands. Alright, so I am now... I'm going to revoke your title, first of all. Let's let's do that, please. Noe Valley had a daughter. I guess she could be Noe Valley, too. Why not? And a son. Definitely not going to be Gordon, though. He's going to be Presidio... All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, you know what? We won the war. Um, eventually, we're going to get this prefecture from this guy. We've revoked it. Have, have we already got it? Yeah, we have the prefecture of Hayward, so now we just have to start, I guess, taking the, the counties. Or we have de jure claims on the counties. So it might be a hard task, but we'll figure out how to do it in the next episode. So once again, I am Marcus Aurelius. I'd like to thank you so much for watching. Have a good one.